Hey, it's uh, Bill Portnova. Today I'm going to show you how to install and set up W3 Total Cash in two minutes or less. I'm going to show you the simple ways that I do it for all my sites. A lot of people do it different than I do, but I do it the safe way and the best way that I believe that you'll get the best bang for your buck, even though this is 100% free. But, you know, you don't want to mess around with too many settings because if you, if you change too many settings, you're going to run into some serious problems and then you're going to you're going to need some serious help. So please just do what I have you, um, what I show you to do. It's going to be very simple and it only takes uh, less than two minutes. So basically what we're going to do is I need you to come to your website, okay? I need you to go to the plugins area. All right, so just click on plugins. Come to the top right there, click on add new. I'm going to have all this information below where in the description box where you'll be able to get this plugin, but it's a lot simpler just to type it in up here, W3 Total Cash, okay? Just click install now. Okay, click activate and we're only going to go over three different steps in the plugin because like I said these are basic steps that are going to make your plug your website load super fast and do a lot better because like I said uh, your loading speed for your website is extremely important for Google and if you have another site that is a lot loading a lot faster than yours but the SEO isn't as good Google is going to place their website above yours every single time and I know this because I've done a lot of extensive testing and found this out, okay? So basically, once you have it installed, come over to Performance over here. Go to General Settings right here. All right. What you need to do is, if this isn't checked right here, you need to enable it right here. Page Cache. Keep it on Disk Enhanced right here. Click Save All Settings. Then what you need to do is you need to scroll down to Browser Cache right here. This one should be checked. Just check it again to make sure. All right, once that's done, then what we do is come over here to Page Cache. All right, then what we're gonna do is we're gonna check this box right here. All right, you can check this one if you want, if you don't wanna cache the uh, front page. All right, so you can check this one if you want or if you don't want, but if you have a static page, it's gonna automatically do it so you don't need to do it, okay? So you can either leave it or not or check it. Click right here for cache uh, feeds, site categories, tags, and comments. All right, if you have an SSL, this will be checked, but this site doesn't, so I'm gonna uncheck it, but if yours is an SSL site, right at the top where it says HTTP with the S, then make sure that's checked, but I'm not going to. Then make sure you check this box right here. If you have a membership sh shop, or just a site where you can get subscribers, you don't wanna cache any of those pages, you want them to see what's fresh now, all right, so just click Save on that and check all these boxes right here. Then what you need to do is scroll down, all right, cache uh, preload right here. You need to enter in your site map here, all right, so just click Save All Settings once you've entered that information there. All right, so we're just going to keep going down here, and then we want you to check this box right here, compatibility mode. I have it already checked, but check it again right there come down to save all settings. Now we're going to come over to here to browser cache. All right. This box is going to be checked. Uncheck it. Check this box right here. Set expired headers. Check this box right here for set ent uh, ent entirely tags, uh, e tags right here. All right. Check that box right there. All right. Just leave all these boxes that are already checked, checked. All right, come down here. This box will not be checked, but check this one that says don't set cookies for static files. All right, come down here and click save. And that is literally it. I'm going to show you, I'm going to go to the page right now, my site. I'm just going to refresh it and show you how fast it loads here. Just so you can see that it just loads a lot faster here. All right, so here we go. If we click on one of these images right here, one of these posts, you can see how it loads up very fast, which, like I said, is very important. We're going to come over here. I'm going to test it out. I'm going to show you. This is what it was loading for before, uh, basically right almost five seconds, which people would have already left a long time ago. This might take a few tries because it might still have the cache from the original site, so we're going to just test this a few times so I can show you this. But right now it has a C right here. The size of the page is 5.4, all right, and the requests were 256, okay, and it was really slow. So we're going to click right here to start the test again. 
All right. Like I said, it was almost five seconds before. All right, let's just refresh it again, but it went from almost five seconds down to three, which is a lot better, okay? And what's going to happen is as this plugin is running, okay, it's going to get better and better as it caches all your pages, okay? As you can, you know, you can see how this number right here is uh, a little over three seconds right now. But what's going to happen is over time, at least in the next 24 hours, this is probably going to drop another, another second or a little bit more down to probably around two seconds. So that's going to help tremendously okay so if this video has helped you and like i said if you look right here you can see that this was a c before now it's a b so you can just tell it keeps improving improving i'll just check one more so i can see i'll just do a dallas one right here so you can see the speed there just to, to check but as this is going on if you like this video i have a free wordpress training website and i'll put all the description below that you can get access to it but it will take you to a whole different level and it will allow you to understand WordPress a lot better, okay? So it's about the same, but tomorrow it's gonna be around two seconds, okay? All right, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have in the description, you're gonna be able to get access to my free training. There's gonna be 53 step-by-step -step training videos that's gonna teach you WordPress and cPanel, okay? Right here, if you scroll down, you're gonna get 16 basic videos. That's going to be just telling you the basics of WordPress. This right here will be 11 videos. It's going to show you how to speed up your WordPress site and make sure it's loading as fast as possible. Just like the things that we just went over today, but a little bit more in depth explaining things. Then you're going to get access to 12 videos that's going to help you with security with your website, making sure people don't get in that aren't supposed to come in. And then here's the 14 training videos of cPanel. Once you're in the members area, you're going to get access to this. This is going to help you because most uh, hosting accounts are cPanel, and if you have no idea about cPanel and you mess something up with your site, this right here is going to help you a lot. It's going to teach you some of the basics. So if you're ready to get started with this, all you need to do, this is 100% free. There's nothing to buy at all. Just click yes, I want this. All right. What you need to do is just make it username, put your email address, add your uh, first name, sign up to the newsletter. We're always letting you know when we have new videos, new training information that's going to help you, anything that we think that can help you with your business and make it better, okay? So make sure you check that box right there. Click register. Once you've signed up, you'll be taken to the members area. Make sure you check out these other services. Uh, this is These are two different softwares right here. They're 100% free. There's nothing to buy. We just want to help you with everything um, that you need to help your business grow and make sure that you're ranking in the search engine right or making sure your videos that you make are going to be ranked well in YouTube and on the first page of Google, okay? So basically, what's going to happen is once you get in here, you're going to get access to all these videos. And here's the basic videos, 16 of them right here. Make sure you go through all of them. It will refresh anything. Even if you know some stuff, you, I'm sure you don't know everything, okay? So all these videos will take you from you know A to Z in the basics of WordPress and really help you a lot to help you understand, okay? Then right here, you're going to basically get some videos that's going to show you how to get your website to load super fast. It's going to help you with the, the stuff we showed you today is going to do some big stuff, but this is going to help you even more, you know, just to get things even better. Okay. Alrighty. This one right here is for security that you don't want anybody to get in. This is 12 videos to go through each one of these. It's going to help you tremendously to make sure that your what your website's secure and that nobody's going to get in, okay? And then here are these uh, 14 uh, cPanel training videos that's really going to take you to the next level, okay? And if you're a person that likes to read an ebook, this will explain WordPress in great detail. This is 100% free. Just click on that. If you want to make some graphics right here, you can sign up for a free account right here. It's 100% free. Just come down here, click on Get Access, fill in your information, and you'll get free access to making banners. Let me just get out of there. And then if you need traffic for your WordPress site, this is 100% free too. We've already delivered over 2.8 billion. And I'll click on the link um, just so you can see. We've actually almost at 5 billion now. All right, and I'm going to close this out. We have this little speaking person over here. But we can load it up right here. See, we're almost at 5 billion traffic impressions that we delivered. So if you want to actually see right here how this whole plugin works, uh, just watch the video here. We'll explain it in detail. But this, this plugin is extremely powerful. So 
I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it's helped you with understanding how to get your website to load faster. Like I said, W3 Total Cache is a very, very good free plugin that's going to help you out tremendously. Um, I wouldn't do any other of the settings that I that I I would just do what I told you today. Uh, because if you do any other changes, like I told you in the beginning, it's going to cause serious problem for you. And if you're new, you're you're going to be lost, and your site's going to be down. And if your hosting a, you know company wants to help you, they may. If not, they might charge you for this. So don't do any other changes than what I showed you today. Okay. So make sure if you like this video, share it, like it, send it to anybody you want. And like I said, come over here to my free training and get your business off to a very good start. All right, this is Bill Portnova. Make sure you add comments below, letting me know what kind of videos you want, and I will create those videos for you guys. Have yourself a great day. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.